Hey everyone, Luck Horse here. Well, as you can see here, Warframe earlier today announced the next candidates for the upcoming Prime Unvaulting. It's going to be Mag and Nova Prime. Now, these are both great frames, and although I haven't put as much time into Nova as I probably would have liked with the sheer range of frames available, I know she is a powerful frame. And then there's also Mag who so many people write off as being absolute garbage tier. And those poor fools, look, they don't just understand the power that she does wield, especially against Corpus and the Armour of Grenier. So in short, two really solid frames are getting offered up for the unvaulting this time around. So let's quickly go through the packs that are getting offered up. First up, there's their Magnetic Mayhem Dual Prime pack, which includes 1200 Platinum, Nova Prime, Mag Prime, Soma Prime, Boar Prime, which is a really awesome shotgun and definitely worth your time investing in, Dacra Prime, the Vasto Prime, and it's a lovely pistol. It's such a nice secondary. The Edo Prime armor set. A lot of people are going to be super excited with this releasing. It's been requested over a long period of time, and it's finally coming back. Now, I'm definitely excited for it coming back too. There's also the Yamako Prime Sandana, and this is a really nice, sleek-looking Sandana, I've got to say. It'll definitely be uh, work well with a lot of our frames, I'm sure. Now, there'll also be the Distilling Extractor Prime and its blueprint, the Valorum Prime Sigil. The Valorum Prime Sigil is a high-quality sigil, which I was kind of hoping would be what the Rift Walker Prime Sigil would be like, but, well, yeah, it, it wasn't exactly. Now, the Valorum Prime Sigil is easily the coolest sigil, I reckon, in Warframe and I'm super excited to be getting it to whack on a heap of my frames. And of course, the usual Prime glyphs that come with both frames will also be part of the pack too. Now, in keeping with previous Prime unvolting pricing traditions, the giant pack will likely set you back $59.99 US. On to the single Warframe packs now, and let's take a look at Nova Prime's pack, which includes 400 Platinum, Nova Prime, Soma Prime, Vasto Prime, Edo Prime Armor Set, Valorum Prime Sigil, and Prime Glyphs and Profile Icons. Now, Mag Prime's pack includes 400 Platinum, Mag Prime, Boar Prime, Dacra Prime, Yamoko Prime Sandana, the Distilling Extractor Prime and its Blueprint, and Prime Glyphs and Profile icons, icons as usual. Now, if previous unvaulting prices for separate frame packs remain the same, then you can expect to pay $39.99 US for each pack. Moving on to the accessory packs, and Nova Prime's accessory pack is gonna include 200 Platinum, the Edo Prime Awesome armor set and the Valorum Prime Sigil. And Mag Prime's accessory pack includes 200 Platinum, the Yamoko Prime Sandana, and the Distilling Extractor Prime and its blueprint. Now, I reckon that both frames unvaulted accessory packs are likely going to be solid purchases. And again, if pricing conventions remain the same, each pack will set you back $19.99 US. Also remember that you can only buy the accessories outside like through Warframe.com. You can't grind for them in Warframe like the frames and weapons parts which you can get through Relics. Overall, these offerings for Nova and Mag Prime appear pretty solid and if you don't have the frames, weapons or accessories, then I reckon one of these packs or more could potentially prove pretty tempting for you. Now the Prime Vault opens on November 13 for PC and Xbox One. The PS4 Tenno need to be aware there are specific regional launch dates, and those launch dates being in North and South America on November 13th, Europe November 14th, Asia November 14th, and in Japan it'll be November 15th. Oh, and there is one final cool launch aspect for the Prime Unvaultings. They're going to be available on the Nintendo Switch from November 20th, when Warframe finally comes to that super-powered little handheld. Now, if you want to know what vids I'll be doing for Mag and Nova Prime's Unvaulting release, They'll include a day one summary of the packs and costs, where you can find the relics for the frames and their weapons, pack reviews, are they good value for money, and fashion frame reviews in separate videos on Edo Prime, Yamako Prime Sandana, and the Valorum Prime Sigil. So make sure you subscribe to my channel and make sure you have your alerts on for my channel as well so that you know when all of my upcoming videos go online. Well, that's it for the summary of Mag and Nova Prime's upcoming unvaulting. What are you looking forward to? Well, make sure you let me know in the comments section below or on Twitter at Lucktorse. Have a good one, guys, and remember, we all lift together. Cheers.